Dear Diary, October 4th, 2017. Um, yeah, this is my messy room. This is what it is. But I haven't, like, sat down and done in, like, a proper Dear Diary in forever. But I just wanted to talk about something because it kind of happened again today. So, as you guys know, if you've been watching my videos, I've been off of birth control for, like, over a month now. And honestly, I've been feeling like complete crap. I feel bloated. I feel fat. I feel gross. Um, I've been breaking out a little bit like around the frame of my face. Just I haven't been breaking out on my face, thank God. But here's the thing. I haven't been wearing different clothes. I'm in my pajamas right now. I haven't been wearing makeup. But I don't know what's happening but I seem to be, be, men have been hitting on me a lot more this past month than usual, which is like, it's just weird. I'm not, you know, I'm not trying to say I'm all that. Like, I think I'm pretty, and of course I have very big boobs, so, you know, that's always a plus. You know, I don't think that I'm ugly, I just don't think that, like, I'm, I'm all that, you know. But I've just been getting hit on like crazy, and... You know, I was like, wait, I, for a minute, I was like, wait, what's going on? Like, what's changed? And I'm like, well, I'm not on birth control anymore. And it's like, it's like the men can smell the pheromones. They're just, it's like, it's like they know, they know that the baby maker is open for business. And I'm, I, I, that's the only explanation I have for it is that they just know that I am ready to go. And I'm not saying that they all want to, like, make a baby with me, but I think on some sort of physiological level, they can sense it on me or something. And that's just been attracting them to me because, like I said, I have not been feeling that great. Actually, I've been, you know, I've been feeling, like, really, really crappy. And it's been hard to, like, get back into making videos and to get back into doing my normal thing, you know, I'm doing my best. Like today I feel pretty good. You know, I'm feeling better so I can tell, I can tell that, you know, things are starting, like my hormones and my body starting to normalize a little bit, but I'm just like, damn, like, why is everybody on my jock right now? Like, I don't hate it, you know. Who, what girl doesn't want to be like hit on, right? And some of them are really cute, you know, and like young. But still cute. Like there haven't there hasn't been some ugly ones. Now there's been some like older men like this like last weekend. This like old guy tried to tongue kiss me. It was really you know, and it's weird because I used to see you know, I see I would see him around and I would talk to him and like he it's like a guy in my neighborhood. He was always super sweet, like always just like wanted to talk about politics or whatever and we would have really good conversations but like this last week it like changed he was like when are you gonna get nasty with me and I'm like what what and he like he's like give me a kiss just give me a little kiss I just want to kiss you you're so beautiful I just want to kiss you and I'm like dude um I didn't think I was like giving off signals, we, you know, I would just say hi to him and we were talking. I didn't think it was like, I wasn't flirting. Yeah, that's weird. That's going to be very awkward. I'm going to really, really have to avoid this man because I'm not going to get nasty with you. I'm sorry. I'm not an ageist, you know. If we get along, we get along. That's great. doesn't matter what age you are. It's just that I never saw him that way. I always just saw him as like an elder and he made good conversation and mm -mm. no, no. And I used to be only into like men that were around my age or a little bit older. Um, I would say probably like in the last two years. I've kind of opened myself up to the younger ones because the younger ones they come with some benefits, not gonna lie, but um, 
I don't know, I feel personally, like, I feel like I've been very hands-off for the past year, two years, year and a half. I feel like I've just been very, like, you know, no thank you. And I still feel like I'm that way, but for some reason, men are approaching me and I'm just like, can you smell my hormones? I don't, what is happening? What is happening? Is it a plus or is it a negative? If they're cute, it's a plus. Uh, if you're like an old ass man, then it's probably a negative. No offense. Anyway, I just thought I just had to uh, share that little tidbit because that's what's been going on lately. Because you saw my other videos. Like I was very like subdued, very just down, just not really feeling that great. And I, I mean, I'm starting to feel better, but I'm just like, like when I walk out the house, I feel gross, but yet men are still coming up to me, which is just like, it's like blowing my mind. It'd be different if I like walked out with my hair done looking all cute and shit, but looking like a hot mess, like I have been looking lately, I'm just like, what, what is happening? What is the deal? Oh, and if you notice, I did re-bleach my hair, went back to bright blue because I missed the bright blue. But anyway, pray for Vegas, pray for Puerto Rico.